Yo, what up? It's your boy Ant Wright. Do me a favor and hit subscribe. I'll be uploading at least four videos per week. Don't want you missing out on future projects. This is your channel as much as mine. So comment below who or what you want me to break down next. Young Gunner. Enoch Boache, pronounced Boache, 6'10", 240-pound big man out of Canada, ranked number 21 in the 2022 class and the number three center. Remember, if they're Canadian, they usually run a bit older, and he's no different. He'll be 19 years old when he graduates. Right now, he's being recruited by Texas Tech, UCLA, Arizona, Houston, Texas A&M, Michigan State, Oklahoma State, Wake Forest, and many more. Uh, his player comp is going to be former big man Thomas Bryant out of Indiana. They're really strong on both ends. Both of them have a really high motor, and college coaches will always tell you that's half the battle. They're glass cleaners, who can also provide rim protection and a bit of offense. They're best when diving to the rim out of a pick and roll, with underrated abilities off the dribble, and elite rim running in transition. Boache and Brian are about the same size, you know, 6'10", between 240 and 250. Uh, Brian was a McDonald's All-American, uh, did a great job at Indiana, earned him all-conference honors, and he now plays with the Washington Wizards. His chin isn't at the rim or anything, but athletically, he's still a very solid A-. minus. The guy tries to dunk everything. Crazy fast going north and south up the court and has a really quick second jump. You'll see it more in the next segment, but he's very mobile and agile for his size at 6'10", 240. He's able to guard quicker players on the perimeter, just causing havoc and chaos. Wingspan is about 7'4 or 7'5. Add in the fact he goes hard with attitude, every possession, that just adds to how unfair he is at the high school level. Driving and handle will also be an A. This is part of his game is what shocked me the most when watching him. He can handle the ball, like legit handle the rock. He pushes the ball in transition and he's very comfortable doing so. You can always tell with his teammates, they don't panic when he starts to push. They either run with him to be ready for his pass or they just get up out the way. Seems like he's out of control, but he's really not. When little guards try to steal the ball or get in his way, he navigates around them fairly easily. Uh, when he's posting, he can go back to the basket and back you down, drop step or spin, but he also likes to face you up and drive the defender baseline. A lot of times, a lot of times, it's always ending with a thunderous dunk. Little tough on him here, but his rim protection is gonna be a solid B. He blocks shots and does a great job at protecting the rim from bigs and penetrating guards who broke down the defense. But with his athleticism and where his wingspan is, he should be doing a better job at high pointing the basketball and not trying to block directly out of the offensive player's hands. This will prevent avoidable fouls. And I know everyone loves the big blocks that are sent to the 10th row, but he'll have a better chance at keeping some of his blocks inbounds to retain possession. What you'd be getting in Enoch Boache is an extremely hardworking big man who is improving vastly every single year. Also, wanted to throw in some clips of him shooting. He doesn't have a lot of video out there for it, but looking at his form, it tells me he'll be able to stretch the floor at the college and the pro level. Dan Dockage. Can't guard me.